very easy, go with the flow, and that's how I cook mostly. I think because when you're making simple food, you let those ingredients shine. It, it tastes the best when it's simple, personally. I love it. So we can make this little pasta dish. So we've got some Parmesan eggs, gorgeous linguine here, and some Lewis Road milk. It's my favorite milk. When you're when you're boiling your pasta, the water is your stock, and the water they say should be as salty as the Mediterranean Sea. It therefore flavors your pasta after that, but. Um, it really makes such a difference, and people who try to say it, it, you know, the pasta tastes different, it tastes meaty almost, so, yeah. Salty as the Mediterranean Sea, that's the key. Separating the eggs. I love the feeling of eggs in my hands. It's the best feeling in the world, it's like a little baby. Stunning. Take care, little one. Thank you for nourishing our bodies. So I'm going to put in some lemons, lemon rind, and parmesan is great um, because of its saltiness. It smells really good. So you kind of need to combat that with um, tartness, sourness from, from the lemon. You put um, the nutmeg in, it gives it some earthiness. Not too much nutmeg though, because it will overpower it. I've got some milk here as well. Just put some milk. So you put quite a bit in there. Just some olive oil. Some, but to some that is a lot. And the nutmeg. And then just whisk it all together. Smells like olive oil. Smells good. I know you probably expected me to cook my own pasta, but who has time for that? As the great Nigella Lawson said, if it's not simple, I'm not doing it. Pasta doesn't look um, like a lot until you actually cook it. So you always want to add more and then you end up with so much pasta. Um, it's very cliche. But I started loving cooking when I was um, a little girl. The first thing I made probably was uh, cakes with my grandma. I remember her sitting on the floor with a big, big, big bowl with dough in it, punching this dough because you really need to work and knead it, knead it well. And she said, come on the ground with me and, and punch this dough. And I really love the fact that me and her were almost playing with food and then we could eat it after. So it was just a lot of fun to me at that time. Pasta al dente has to have just a bit of bite to it. So uh, everyone says it should stick on the wall, but really you just have to, I mean, when you look inside, it's just almost, it's translucent a little bit, but it's got a little bit of uncookedness about it. But it's nice, it should never go over because then it's doughy and you can really taste the difference. But that salt has made such a difference. Can you just have some? Have this, I've touched it so many times. But What I did before I took um, drained the water is I took a little bit of that water, and that's a stock. Make sure you stir when you're um, when you're cooking your pasta as well. Just every now and then come and stir because especially linguine clumps together. It pasta loves sticking together. I've got my mixture here, and what I'm going to do to avoid scrambling you. Stir as you pour, and you're going to continue stirring until the sauce thickens. Oh, it smells so good. This is my ultimate comfort food. Okay, what it looks like now is it looks like there's a lot of liquid in there, and you're going to have like a watery, creamy, weird, milky soup, but it actually thickens, and it's lovely when you're going to eat it because there's actually a lot of creaminess and sauce there. And what the heat is doing here, it's cooking the pasta just a little bit more. Uh, we had it al dente. This is just gonna cook it a little bit more. And the lemon rind 
the flavor of that is going to infuse with the heat. And it's just gonna get richer and richer. The nutmeg will be a little bit more prominent. A year ago, I realized that I want my life to be dedicated to making people happy. And uh, I'm truly happiest when I'm kind to others. When I make food, I bring people together, people laugh, I put a smile on their face. I, it's just, it's, it's a great feeling. So it's as simple as that. I make food to make people happy. Cooking is fun. So when you're serving pasta, you're just meant to be turning the, and I'm doing this really uncomfortably, but turning the plate as you're turning your hands the other way. And you kind of have it prompt up a little bit. Like that. Parmesan over the top. You have to always put Parmesan over the top. 